chosen showdown for today is between two NBA superstars, Luka Doncic, who might be a bit heavier, and Giannis Antetokounmpo, the most dominant player in the NBA. As you can see, Luka is younger and averages more points per game, but Giannis does have the clear size advantage, MVP awards, and championships won. This fight will reveal who is the better player. This should be a good one. Uh, let's get ready to rumble! Fighter number one, Luka Doncic. At 24 years, 300 days old, Doncic is the sixth youngest player to reach 10,000 points behind LeBron James, Kevin Durant, Kobe Bryant, Carmelo Anthony, and Tracy McGrady. Doncic might also be the toughest pick and roll cover in the NBA right now. We all know Luka is pretty slow. He doesn't have a quick three-point trigger as the likes of Stephen Curry and Damian Lillard, but he does have just about everything else at a league best level. Finney Smith to inbound. Back to Doncic. Doncic pulls up, three-pointer. Bang! Bang! It's good! Doncic wins the game at the buzzer! Doncic has been outstanding finishing around the rim, connecting on 77.3% of those opportunities. That's exactly what you'd expect to see from, you know, Giannis Antetokounmpo, who is an absolute giant, running at 260 pounds at your face. But Luka can somehow finish almost every single time being a big round ball, but also highly efficient and strong. Luka sees shit that's just like, <laughs> bro, how? Luka plays at his own pace, uses his body well to shield defenders, and has the footwork to do things like Euro step his way around them. He also has a very incredible and soft touch. Not being able to dunk on people might be his only limit when it comes to finishing. I might just say it, he could be the best one-on-one -on -one scorer in the NBA. He can shoot, pass, dribble, lead, be a playmaker. He can do it all, except defend. Over his last 12 games, he is averaging 37 points, 9 rebounds, and 11 assists. Currently, he is 2nd in the league in scoring, 3rd in assists, 2nd in 3-pointers made, has shooting splits of 49, 39, and 79, and the Mavericks are 18 and 12, which places them 5th in the West. Not only should Luka be in the MVP conversation, he should be the main talking point. Fighter number 2, the Greek Freak. Giannis is just different. Turnover for Admiral Schofield, 11th in the game for Orlando, and a drive by Giannis Adetokounmpo. He also gave credit to assistant coach Mike Dunlap. The Greek god has collected multiple accolades and accomplishments. He is a two-time MVP, a defensive player of the year, and has been selected to multiple All-Star teams. Additionally, he was the main reason the Milwaukee Bucks won an NBA championship in 2021. Giannis joined Wilt Chamberlain as the only players in NBA history to average at least 30 points, 10 rebounds, and 5 assists while shooting 50% from the floor. You are now the Bucks' all-time leading scorer. You passed Kareem Abdul-Jabbar with your performance this evening. What does that mean to you? Yeah, it's, a, it's, it's a compliment. You know, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, uh, all-time leading scorer in the NBA uh, for the Bucks. Also, just being able to be up there with him, it's, it's, a, it's a compliment and uh, it's a lot of hard work that I've paid off, but uh, I gotta keep, you know, staying humble, you know, if I stay humble, stay hungry and keep enjoying the game, good things gonna happen for me and for my teammates. Giannis is the perfect storm of size and athleticism that lets him just dominate in that paint and run towards the basket like he was shot out of a medieval cannon. He is great offensively and equally defensively. Unlike Luka, Giannis is a first-team all-defensive team member. He has also had all-time legendary moments such as the block, the valley oop, and the 50-burger in consecutive games in the finals. It's over. The Bucks have done it. The long wait has ended after a half century. The Milwaukee Bucks are NBA champions once again. The decision. One day we will say Giannis is the best player in the league, period. Giannis is a better player than Luka Doncic. In a 1v1 game, Giannis would tower over him and hold Luka down on the defensive end. Although Luka is a supreme superstar, not taking anything away from his game, Giannis is just a better leader, defensive player, and can almost guarantee you a bucket every single time. Congratulations to Giannis.